Okay, hello everyone. It's been a while since I actually, actually been getting fans for almost like six months since like the last fan I got. The last fan I ever got was the Hampton Bay Carousel back there because uh, I didn't have the right blades and I think there was, some of them were like too big and the brackets were too small. And I think because the carousels had, I think a, one's older and one's newer, so it's, that's why. Anyway. Here are my two fans I got at the ReStore today. Uh, I actually sadly didn't find a smaller ceiling fan like a Cosmocalia, Target Hugger, or anything like that. So, what I'm probably going to be doing is I'm probably going to be actually installing one of these smaller fans in my room temporarily until I find a, like a permanent fan for it. So I'm thinking about maybe putting the corner up there temporarily, but I'm not sure. But we're, we're gonna have to discuss about with my parents and I. And uh, yeah, I don't know. Maybe I should just leave this one alone. Maybe replace that one, but I don't know yet. I'm gonna have to discuss this one with my parents because I don't know about that. But anyways, here are my two hands I got from the Habitat Restore today in Winchester. It wasn't really a lot, but. There wasn't any small ceiling hands, but anyways, here are the fans I got today. This is a Hunter Studio Series remote. Um, both of these, and and over here we got this Hampton Bay. Uh, it says Hampton Bay. I forget what the model of this is called because I don't remember all my fans, but I do remember a lot of fans anyways. Because I remember, of course, um, these, of course, you know, you know, I've seen them on the internet. I've seen them in the 2004-2005 catalog. I mean, no, I don't even have those catalogs. But I saw, I've saw, i seen them, you know, of course, online from posts online. Look at what these Hampton Bay things are called. Uh, <laughs> I don't remember all of them, but I remember a lot. But uh, both of these fans actually came 100% complete. And, uh, of course, let me just show you the little features about it. There's the remote control with the Hunter Studio Series remote. So this would be the light go goes to that. And turn off. Speed one, speed two, speed three. And then I think this these two errors are supposed to be reverse. But the reason why I actually got this fan. The reason why I got this fan is because of this cool light kit that was adapted to it. Because you know, I think, you know, with the slight kit attached to it, you know, it kind of looks very interesting to it. So that's why I kind of got it. And of course, this slight kit has a pole chain connected to it. But, uh, it actually has no pole chains because the remote receiver, I believe, is supposed to be inside the switch housing. Because it came with a receiver, but it should be inside the housing. And, uh,. There's the Hampton Bay. Oh yeah, here's the bowl that came with it. And the Hampton Bay blades are right there. Those are the blades for the Hunter Studio Series. And these, uh, originally these actually, uh, these lights are supposed, this like it is with candelabra balls, so which has three of them. I don't know if they work, but I'm, I hopefully they do. But I have this Hunter original here. It's been up for the past couple of days now been kind of experimenting with this one and uh i know when i you know when i turn it on low it, when i turn it on low if i just like pull the pole chain on low and then i turn it on you know the fan starts up really really slow and then it speeds up and speeds up and i think it still needs a lot of oil so either i'm gonna have to demonstrate this high medium and then low instead of you know low medium and then high like I normally do with my other fans here. So, uh, yeah, yeah, um, I really, I really love this one the most. But, uh, yeah, and I actually got this one too, so it actually has those. This is almost like red, but it's not really red, red, but it's almost like, it almost kind of, like, if you turn on the light, it almost looks like it's kind of red a little bit, like lighter red. But this is more like, I don't know what type of finish you would call these. But this all, the top part, half of this is like sandstone or whatever. And so, I know the Russian Fazbear has a white one like this. 
This fan actually, according to the top, was say one ninety five. So I was, I would assume it will be in January of nineteen ninety five. Where's this one? Ah, uh, don't know when this one was manufactured, but I don't really want to look at it. But. Yeah. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy, and see y'all later. And tomorrow's the Fourth of July. So thanks for watching.